Hi everyone, it's Vanessa. Thank you for watching my video. I am three and a half weeks post-op tummy tuck and liposuction procedure. And I just wanted to do this video um, for my three weeks update. I know I'm a little late, I'm sorry. It's been pretty busy. Yeah. And here's Ethan's head pointing. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's mama. Okay, sorry about that. Um, so my number one thing that has been bothering me this week is the itching. My skin itches so bad. Like, oh my gosh. Like, I'm just like, to the point where I'm like, oh, and I don't want to scratch because I don't know if it's itching because if I'm getting new stretch marks or I don't, I honestly have no idea why it's itching. Some people say it's itching because it's starting to heal and the nerves are starting to work, but it is itching like crazy. Like it itches around my incision and then it itches like on my actual abdomen. So what I've been doing is just like rub, just rub, 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 rub because I, I don't want to get new stretch marks. <laughs> Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> so I already had some stretch marks like left over. Which oh he's letting you know he has an owie. Yes, I know. You're an owie. Um so the stretch marks, oh my gosh. Um this is me. Three weeks post op. This is swollen. I just put aloe vera, I mean, aloe vera plant and vitamin E because I'm going to try to get rid of some of these stretch marks. Yeah. He like just loves the camera. Okay. So I'm probably gonna make a video. Do you, do you want this video to be about you? Yeah. They had mentioned about getting massages for um you know to just for the draining and I didn't really like hear about anything like that so that's when I asked my doctor and my doctor said yeah that I could actually do that myself so I'm gonna start doing that it hurts though like to rub it so maybe I could like see if like I don't know I could convince somebody to like hey rub my side right here real quick and just you know see if I could get them to rub it um also the doctor taped my um, incision for another week with the silicone strips and um, when he changed them honestly like dude my scar is so thin and so like hidden like oh my god like honestly he did an amazing job on my scar and um, he actually um, is having me use bio corneum on my belly button scar and then once he stops taping my incision scar then he wants me to use that on um, my incision as well to help with the scar and so I won't get any hyperpigmentation and I'll just help make it fade and I've actually been using a little bit on my stretch marks so I'm not supposed to I'm supposed to be saving the bottle for my incision but I wanted to try it on my stretch marks too but we'll talk about that in the stretch marks video. But um, let's see what else. Pretty good for three weeks. And then when I bend over, still no rolls. This right here though is super swollen. So I hope it goes down. And right here, I don't really have any fat for them to grab there's a little bit but nothing crazy let's see see like there's only a little bit which is good 
Probably could have done a little bit more, but it's fine. So hopefully I get rid of these stretch marks. I can't wait till I get to go to the gym and work out the rest. Oh, this feels so pushed out right here. Oh man. So yeah, that's my update for three weeks. Um, just honestly, prepare yourself for the itching because the itching is crazy. Oh my God. Um, I thought it was the binder and I like took the binder off like so I could breathe for a couple minutes. And no, so it just, just it, it's crazy. The itching is horrible. And um, the doctor said that in about another week, I could start working out again. Um, he said right now I could walk fast if I want to. Um, but honestly, I get out of breath really easily. So, mm. But I did weigh myself. And I've lost about 13 pounds. Which is weird because I'm swollen. But I'm excited because that means I'm going to lose more. And I've noticed too, like in other parts of my body, I'm getting thinner but I think it's because of the eating honestly because I am not eating even half of what I used to and I think that has a lot to do with it and I hope that my appetite stays like this um, because yeah I, I get full so fast and I'm you know really you know resisting a lot of the junk um, so yeah well that's my update and say bye Ethan <laughs> you're not listening to me um but yeah so let me know um if you have any comments or concerns i hope you guys are doing fabulous and i will talk to you later bye say bye bye <laughs> bye